so bad you know you've got like a wee baby see i just look so much healthier with a tan like i just did a layer of fake tan oh god that's really bad oh <gasps> look i've been leaning on the fucking desk and it's gone like that oh it's I fine it'll be fine muscle. when i wash it off but i just did a layer of fake tan and i just feel so much healthier and glowy for it really does change it literally does. really does elevate my look and like my mood Anyway, welcome back to my channel. I thought I'd do a little <laughs> vlog of like first week back at like, ugh, what am I on about? First week back at third year uni. Um, so it's been my first week. Maddie hasn't even gone in yet, which is weird because her uni always goes back before me. So I'm confused why I'm back before you. I can't wait for my routine. I know. Um, but I'm early in Monday, Friday, this semester, so it's quite nice, like, going on Monday, then I have, like, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday to, like, prep, do more work, and then Fridays, I'm back in. So it's quite a nice routine, I don't mind it, I don't mind it, but I was supposed to vlog today, and I didn't, but I'm going to vlog tomorrow, and tonight, so it's fine, but today we just, like, woke up, did some work, had a mooch around, um, we almost got killed by a Caesar salad. The most disgusting Caesar salad I've ever had in my life. Oh. It was so bad. Like me and Maddie had to come up and sit on the sofa and reevaluate our lives. So Maddie's still kind of ill from yeah, it. I'm so ill. I felt better because, like, you know, when you you've got a taste in your mouth, it's making you feel sick. So when I got that taste out of my mouth, I felt so much better. But anyway, we've got it's the first history social of the season tonight i sound like fucking Woo! bridgeton ball of the season um and my friend is in the social sect for this year so we're gonna go if anyone remembers gareth from the history ball he's a social sect so i promised him that we'd go i've actually never this is surprising i've actually never been to a history social except the ball in june so i'm a bit like i don't know really know i feel like a fucking fresher like i don't know what to expect but we're gonna go and we're gonna look cute and just have like a fun night. Even though I'm in at 9 a.m. tomorrow, it doesn't matter. <sighs> but I'm gonna have a shower now and do some makeup. So who's excited for the history social? Woo. This girl, she hasn't been to any of her. I what do you do? Well. So she, philosophy. philosophy. She hasn't been to any of her philosophy events, but she's been to two of my history I know. things. I'm gonna get one of these. She's things. an honorary. I know <laughs> I have. I had to tell people I go there as well. I'm like, yeah. Like, oh. You're gonna have to tell people we do history tonight because like I wanted to at the ball and they're like, really, I've never seen you before. I was like, oh I just I'm just there. All she's the time. just there. She's an honorary student, but yeah, I'm I'm kinda excited. I don't know what to wear. Because it's like chilled, isn't it? It's like trainers. I talk a lot of shh when I'm wasted, baby. That song is now gonna be in my head. We're getting ready, we're showered, we're tanned. I literally don't know what to expect. Please tell me if you've been to a social. Yeah, I've been to a couple. What are they like? They are full of pressure, I'm not gonna lie. Are they? Embarrassing. We're just there, we're gonna go find Gareth. Is that enough? And have some adult drinks. Yeah. Um, anyway, this is the foundation I use at the moment, True Match Nude. I love that. It's fucking insane. I'm not gonna lie. Got this deal for my birthday. I prefer the True Match. Yeah, Millie has that, I don't really mind. Yes. It. I, I used to, I used Chintzy's once and I was like, oh my god, this is insane. Well, this one just does not hit the same, so I'm using True Match. Oh, you've got Infallible, but Infallible is really good. It's just different, like... I'm just gonna drop this onto my face. So, I was singing that today, and then yesterday I was singing The Love One. I think I'm in love... What's that, TikTok? The um, oh. the, all the cu cute couples are doing at the moment. Yeah. What is it? Can't remember the name. I think I'm in love. That one. Be love. More specific. Come on, it's on Shrek or something. Oh. And they're like lying down together like. What's the problem? Oh, maybe. <laughs> Says like, what's the problem? I think I'm in love, love. Think about it every time I think about it. Can't stop thinking about it. So that has been in my head as well. So yeah, that's great. 
but we're getting ready. We're literally, this Caesar salad has fucked us up so much that we're not even hungry for dinner. I'm not gonna bait them out because it's literally not no, fair. Because you all might like it, but we just didn't. I, I managed to eat half and I was like, okay, it's not that bad. But when I stopped eating it for a little while and then went back to it, that was when I was like, this does not taste good. And they were like 12 pounds. So what kind of morning? The morning, the loss of our money. Because we could have gone other places, but it's fine. It's fine. It's okay. It's fine. Learn. What do you think you're going to put on tonight? Like body suit and jeans. Nice. I've got a white corset and cargoes, I think. She said, what's the problem? See, this looks really nice and glowy, this foundation. And it doesn't feel like you've got foundation on. If that makes sense. But this light is not amazing. My eyes always go really red. I don't know why that is. Oh, is it over here? Yeah. I'm literally using this as my light. But we're off to the social now. This is what makeup looks like. Looks really nice. And then it's just got this cute corset on. And yeah, living life. Woo! This, the light in my apartment is so <gasps> bad. Honestly, I bought this corset last night and it came today and it's actually stunning. Really snatches me in. And I've literally just got jeans on. Like this, this corset's very, I don't know if it's a bit too booby. What do you think? Cute. I had to put jeans on. I was going to put cargoes on, but it looked weird. But I put some jeans on. What do you think, girl? You're looking to me. Yeah. Love it. And this girl's got on. So cute with some jeans. Some jeans. We're all ready to go. I don't know if I'll bring the camera. I think it's a bit too... In your face, I might just vlog on my phone. But anyway. Hello guys, how are we? It's now Friday morning. I'm whispering because I don't want to wake Maddie up because she's not feeling well. She texted me in the night saying that she was sick, so we're just being very quiet. This is ASMR mornings, um, but I've just put a little bit of makeup on just to feel, you know when you're like meeting new people, you just want to feel a bit presentable, a bit put together. So that's what I've come for. And then I've got this tracksuit on, which is really comfy and cozy and, I couldn't really think of anything else because it's like half nine in the morning so I mean half eight in the morning so I just threw this on but it's my lecture about transnational fascist Italy and Nazi Germany that's what we're learning about today so very interesting subject very interesting and we like compare the two in this module and the guy I had for a module last year and I really liked him he's a bit intense but he's really nice he like makes it make sense He's really good at explaining things, so it's going to be good. And some friends that I met at the History Social last night that I was talking to, there seems to be quite a big group of us from last year's module, which was, like, pretty similar in this year's module. So, yeah, it's going to be a good group of us. And I know a couple of familiar faces, so that's good. But I'm on my way. It's 9 till 12, this. I think because it gets to a certain time where it gets so early that I think I'm going to struggle to get an Uber. But it's fine. The uni's only like, the uni's not far. But you know when it's like so early in the morning that like you, you're not hungry so you don't want to have breakfast till later? That's currently what I'm experiencing. But if I go into like the three hour block with no breakfast, I'm going to be so hungry at like half ten. Because like you're thinking it's like brain power. So this is like the moral dilemma that I get myself in, but I'm really not hungry. So I think I'm just gonna take a banana and a water and have like brunch. Okay, we just finished our lecture seminar. It's supposed to be a three hour block, but thank God he finished an hour early because I was falling asleep. But we just grabbed a pret. 
a little matcha, even though it looks like the most liquidy. I don't know, I think I prefer the Starbucks to the prep one. This is made with rice coconut and it gives it like a sweeter taste, but I think I prefer the Starbucks one. But we're just nipping into town now. We want to do some shopping. I need to go to Boots and like pick up some like boring household items that I need to just stock up my cabinets. Um, and then I also want to go and buy some new headphones because I bought a new laptop over the summer and Apple had this deal for students and it's like you get a £120 gift voucher or something. So I'm taking that. I'm using that as a, um, as a sign and I'm going to go and buy those big ass headphones because I don't think I could justify the full amount but because I got £120 off I'm like why not? Why not? <laughs> so I'm going to go and see what colours in the flesh what they look like. Chintzia has the red pair and they don't like You're the pinky pair them. but yeah I don't really I don't really I'm not a big fan of them so I might get the blue but we'll see. Okay, but these are all the colours. So this is the green and the silver and the blue and then the reds are over there. I think Chin's got the red, but I'm just not... I think they're a bit too bright now because it's like wintery. But the green are really cute. I think it's just because I'm wearing red today. I just can't figure it out. But I'll show you the green on. But I think I'm leaning towards the silver the most because they're just classic. But look, they come in the... And I don't really like the colour of the case. It's just a bit like forest greeny. This is our mirror, but we're just choosing what colour to get. And these are the the blue ones, but I'm just not. I'm not. I think it's because I'm wearing red today. But if you just take away my outfit, I just don't know. But these are the green. They literally just look like the silver ones, but with a little bit of difference. These are the green. They are similar to silver. I kind of, oh, if you want to call it, they're still similar enough to silver. I literally you can't hit silver. anything right now. I, I know. I think I'll just get these and then like regret it. But well, look, look in here. Look, you can barely tell that they're green. Yeah. I don't know. This is hard. Okay, we. We. I was gonna come back, but I was like, you know what? I can't be asked. Yeah, you want I know I want silver. Let's just stop dilly dallying. If there was a lilac, I'd get the lilac in a heartbeat. How cute would the lilac be? So cute. I need to be on the Apple design team because a cute iridescent lilac. So cute. But I'm gonna get the silver just because it's a staple. I shouldn't have really worn red today. I'm just kind of clashing with the green. But you know, silver is staple. I'm just very indecisive and I just don't want to regret it. Yeah, I'm like so indecisive. Oh, it's because I'm a Virgo, but we're gonna wrap this up and go shopping. This is how long distance friends work. Look, we make breakfast on FaceTime. What are you having? Pizza toast. Ooh, with an egg. Beautiful. Beautiful. I've got my bagel in. Can I have some smoked salmon and some egg? I bought some egg mayo yesterday from M&S. Um, and I'm kind of living for it. I've always loved egg mayo. But yeah, this is my little breakfast setup. Just cleaned the kitchen, unloaded the dishwasher. I'm adulting. I'm adulting. Also, let's just say RIP to this mug that I bought in New York and I smashed it on the way here. <gasps> look, yeah, look, look. So sad, but I want to keep it because it's just sad and then I've put my jewelry in there. You know when you just can't throw something away? I'm that person, so it's just going to go up here for now. Until I go back and get another one, it's just going to take pride of place right there. One half of my bagel is done and I've just prepped some melon because I bought a cantaloupe melon yesterday and it's the best. So I just cut it all up and then what I do is... To keep it fresh, I'll just put it in one of these containers because like putting half a melon in here is a joke. Anyway, I went shopping yesterday. Maybe I'll give you a food shop because I forgot to show you that because I was so tired. But this is what my fridge looks like currently. Maybe I'll give you a little food haul later. Ugh. Um, But I've not been loving the smoked salmon recently. So I don't know if to have like one egg, one smoked salmon or like both egg, I don't know, but I'm kind of like recreating the saddles breakfast. So I bought these sesame bagels, I don't know, but I use the garlic and herb Philadelphia and it's so much tastier than just the normal one. Delicious.
this is my breakfast so i went with half egg half salmon and i put like loads of pepper on it honestly my taste was a really changed at the moment because i used to be a bagel hater hater like my boyfriend used to eat bagels every morning i used to be like don't get that fucking near me i hate them and i used to be a black pepper hater like i i don't like pepper i don't put pepper in my food but on this it's fucking delicious i don't know what's happened to me i love bagels and i love pepper honestly i don't know what's happened to me babes my taste buds have really changed but i've still got my pjs on and i'm gonna sit here and eat my breakfast maddie's still in bed because she's not feeling very well um i don't know i think she feels just a bit run down she got a bit a bit fluey so she's just still in bed i've just made her a bagel and i'll probably just put modern family on and just have a nice saturday morning and i'm gonna eat this and i think i'm gonna do some pilates i didn't update you from yesterday because i did basically i didn't vlog because i was so tired i literally got home and i was like oh i'm gonna pass out i'm so tired and i got caught in a fucking tropical rainstorm out there in manchester so i thought Today is not my day to vlog, um, but basically, as I was buying the headphones, obviously I told you I had that gift voucher, that £120 one from Apple. So basically, as I was like, we just typed in on the internet, like Apple headphones, whatever, and Curry's has a £100 off sale right now on the headphones. And I was like, oh, so I can get them for £100 off and don't have to use my gift voucher, which I could just buy like cool phone cases with or something and put towards a phone or something or if my charger breaks. So we said to the Apple guy, sorry bud, and he was like, oh, like, I was like, look, I'm just going to think about what colour I want and I'll come back. And he was like, yeah, yeah, that's fine. Went to Curry's, bought them for like 100 quid cheaper and I have to go and pick them up today. So, and I've still got my gift voucher. So if anyone's on the market for those headphones, Curry's have like a hundred pounds off right now. So there's your tip. So I think I'm gonna walk in today, get a protein shake. And yeah, I hate going into town on Saturday because it's rammed, always rammed. But we're gonna brave it, we're gonna brave it. Might, might pop into Zara as well because I need to get some autumn winter bit. Autumn, autumn winter bits. And I did a naked order, but just gonna get my Disney Plus on. Ooh, Lydia. I'm Belle. I might go that. I might go as Belle for Halloween, you know, because of my black hair. I'm kind of feeling it. Oh, what should I watch? I'm not feeling that. You know what? I don't even know why I asked because I'm literally going to put Modern Family on. You know, I guys love it. Oh, play. This is my outfit to go into town with really cute I've got my shades on but i can't really see anything in them i don't actually know where this coat is from i got it last year i want to say like do you know where i got this coat from was it i need to check now because that's gonna bug me because i got it last year and i never loved it but now i love oh top shop top shop fucking hell yeah i must have got it on asos there you go guys that's the answer wouldn't have guessed that actually might wear this outfit to uni on monday because it's fucking comfy anyway this is my outfit so coat is asos top shop vest is aym these are just some black gym leggings and then i got my black uggs on um and then my little bag which is also top shop asos Honestly, I saw a TikTok the other day and it was like, Topshop needs to come back because their bits on ASOS are really fucking good. And I can vouch for that because I'm wearing two things from Topshop, which I stand. But anyway, Maddie's not feeling very well, are you? So she's going to sit out the town trip. But I'm going to go and pick up my, um, my headphones. Which I'm excited for. I'm going to go pick them up. And then also I'm going to nip to Selfridges. I basically did everything I needed to get yesterday. Because I got like all my boots bits. But I'm going to nip to Selfridges. See if there's any like skims bits. Or like cute new bags. I don't know. Um, and then get a matcha. And then I'll come home I think. But yeah. I did my makeup just to feel a little bit more put together on this Saturdays. So I think Saturdays I'm not going to do any work. And then Sunday, I'm going to do my work for Monday. So I'm kind of having just like a day off of fun. No, I'm just shopping and I just saw this bag. And Chinzia says she wanted this bag, but I also want it. But I just don't think it's a wise move to get a fluffy bag 
when I literally live in Manchester. Like, I could not bring this out if it was raining. Can you imagine? But they have a green one, and then they have these, like, mini... Maybe if they had a mini one, I'd get it, but... I just can't wear these in Manchester. And I just picked up some skims. Okay, I've just come to Starbucks, and I got a matcha. This is what I get. So I get four pumps of vanilla and only two matcha powders usually they put three in but that's like way too much for me so i only get two and i got chintzia a belated birthday present because basically it was my dad's birthday on monday and i'm going home this weekend to like celebrate and she when she was home she kept stealing my cup and i just saw these and i thought i'll get these to her, to her ugh, i'll get these for her as a late birthday present because there's an orange one this be a green one, and I think this is like a spotty one, look. I think they're on the back. But they're like really cool colour changing ones. And she literally would not leave mine alone. And I had to actually prize it out of her hands when she went back, because that's literally my only cup. So I got these for her birthday, I think she'll like them. And I got some skims, which I'll show you when I get home. And then I went to go and pick up my headphones, which I'm gonna do an unboxing when I get back. I'm just gonna sit here and drink my matcha. I just got home, opened up my headphones, and they've given me the wrong colour. CBA. Literally, on the receipt, it says silver as well, and these are black. It's like, oh my god. And I'd, I'd keep them, but I just, I, I prefer the silver, so I'm going to have to go back tomorrow. Literally third time lucky trying to get these. Such a pain in the ass. I should have just ordered them, but whatever. Um, yeah. It's great. It is 12 o'clock and all I've done today is worked out and have a shower but that's fine because it's a Sunday, it's fine because it's Sunday. I've literally just got out of the shower, feel so fresh, put this little crop top on from Brandy Melba which I'm not really a fan of but whatever. Um, and I did a little workout which was nice because basically I want really want to join a gym, I just don't know which join, gym to join because I don't like pure gym in town. And like I want one that's a bit more low key around me. So I'm gonna put it on my Instagram story and see if like there's a cool one that I can join nearby. But I just hate pure gym, I really don't wanna go. So I bought some like free weights and I did that today. And it feels good. Like it's it's I like it like I enjoyed it. I just want like a squat rack, a leg press you know like the key machines that I'm missing. But this is alright for the meantime. Anyway, I'm gonna make some breakfast or lunch now because I just wasn't hungry this morning and I always like to work out when I've not eaten anything. I just feel, I feel better for it because I always feel a bit sick if I eat and then work out. But the kit, the, the room's kind of messy. I could devour a bagel. So I bought some sesame ones the other day and I've literally had them every single day. If anyone's watched the New York vlogs, we used to go to this place called Saddles and they used to have like a bagel tower which is just like all different toppings and then they used to give you like a bagel each and it was insane and i had egg mayo and smoked salmon and cream cheese and i literally those are the top things on my shopping list this week <laughs> is served i don't know when i'm gonna get sick of this because i've literally had it about four days in a row but i'm obsessed right let me get the remote put some modern family on or something maddie's here she's from the dead <laughs> you're all right though aren't you i feel a lot like that maybe. good maybe you should have a nice nutritious breakfast to make you feel better yeah i think so get some cheerios in you Cheers and a banana. Anyway, we're gonna eat my breakfast. Oh, this is what Sundays are for, am I right? right? I wish we were going for a roast, like going out for a roast. Can we go for next week? Yeah, we'll go next week. Oh, I thought this vlog would be like super productive, and like I thought I'd like go into town and stuff, but we just literally been sat on the sofa. I had my bagel. We were watching a bit of Zoe Silk. Iconic. Ottilie is so cute. She's so cute! 
uh, so we're just watching all of her vlogs basically. So we're just gonna have a very, very chill day. I need to do some work. I'm gonna do a bit of cleaning later though. And I got a bit of work to do, but yeah, we're just gonna have a very wholesome chill day. And I'm just uploading um, a September photo dump Woo. onto Instagram. Which, let me show you, because actually my phone's gonna episode. die. What is everyone's favorite Modern Family episode? Like, I just have too many that are my favorite. I like the one where they go onto the lake. That's, That's so hilarious. Funny. And I like the ones where they go on holiday and stuff, like when they go on trips. Mm. Like Hawaii, that's a really good one. No, Australia. That was a good one. That's a good one. I just fucking love all of them. There's not one episode that I don't like. So, are you going to put on the... This one. Is it this one in the background? Oh no, it's first days. Oh no, did I just post that? I don't think I did. This is my September dump. Cute, took this the other day. Let's do a behind the scenes of all my images. So I took this behind the day when me and Mads were on a walk. A really cute New York hat that I got in New York. And I'm now addicted to matcha. So you'll find a matcha in my hand at all times. New York skyline. This is my be real of me and the girls in New York, love it. This is the breakfast, the morning of Chintzia's birthday. This is me on my walk again. Really cute, really cute. Ah, oh, this is my favourite picture. Me, Liv and Maddie and we were out for Olivia's little sister's 18th and we took her to Botanist, our favourite place, and it's just so cute. Love this picture. Love you guys. This is New York. This is me and Maddie when we went to the History Social. This is my view of my aeroplane on the way home. And this is me, Soph and Chin, last week at Chin's birthday. And that's it. And the caption is September. Good morning, everyone. I have an exciting day today. I have a full day of uni, pretty much. And then I'm off to London for this really exciting event. So it's kind of like the best of both worlds today. And I'm just literally just had a shower. Showed you my morning routine. Uh, I faked tan last night. Just put a little bit of St. Moritz on um, and I feel better for it. But I just quickly need to pick an outfit before I go and make breakfast and pack a little bag for tonight. Because basically I'm gonna have to bring my little suitcase to uni because I haven't got time to go home after uni and pick my bag up. But it's only like a little suitcase, so like, I'm not that bothered. But Maddie said I could borrow her jumper for uni today which is this USA one. We actually got it at this cool vintage sh shop near us. And then I was just gonna wear it with, just gonna wear it with some cycling shorts and I've literally just shaved my legs. So maybe that's something with like a little vest underneath so I can always take it off if I'm hot. Okay, this is what it looks like. It's like an XXL, but I really love it because it like covers my bum. Aloe yoga cycling shorts. Really cute, and I'm just gonna wear my Uggs. Basically, I washed my hair last night, but I didn't dry it. So it's kind of gone like frizzy. But I don't have time to straighten it, because I need to put a little bit of makeup on and have some breakfast. So I might just have to run a brush through it. But now I'm gonna put on a little bit of makeup, just so I feel a bit alive for the seminar. Because it's a three hour one, and you know when you just wanna look presentable. Um, and then I'm just gonna quickly make a bagel, and then go, I've literally got about half an hour. Morning seminars are always a rush, but this is my case that I'm going to bring. I just need to put my makeup in there, so I'll pack that up last minute. Okay, it is. I'm whispering because Maddie's asleep. I just want that. So it's 8.04, so I need 10 minutes to do my makeup and then I need to make breakfast. So this is, this is a rush. This is a big rush. But I'm just going to put a little bit of... Um, I'm just going to do concealer um, and bronzer, that's it really. I just want to look a bit fresher, do you know what I mean? My beauty concealer. This shit is insane. I'm using you as my mirror. I don't know how good this will be, but... And then I'll just do cream bronzer and a bit of blush. Okay, 906. I've got time, I've got time. 
or focus. See how my hair, this, this is like this weird curly thing. I wish I could straighten it, but I'm just gonna have to leave it like this. I'm just gonna have a quick bagel. I'm an egg mayo kid love egg mayo so i bought a par and it's the most delicious thing i've ever eaten and i don't understand why i don't buy it so this will be a regular occurrence in my weekly shop brekkie is served i've got about 10 minutes to eat this because i have to go and, have to go and pick up a parcel from the concierge for my trip so i need to eat this really fast because it is currently quarter past so i probably need to leave at about half past i didn't cut them in half which is stupid So good, but I'll definitely have to redo my lips. I'm all ready. This is what I'm wearing. Cute. I don't know if I like the coat, but I didn't really have another coat that went over this jumper. But I've got my little suitcase with me, all ready to take to uni. Okay, See? I've made it. Is it boring? We're in the process of my makeup. It's not looking as good as it did last time. It's looking really good. She's just being a bit. She didn't even ask me what I wanted. I'm just doing your classic. Didn't even show you a picture. Look. But did I want that? This is my go-to look me. that I do on myself, and I did on you last but time. But you didn't ask me. Anything. Doesn't matter. Maybe I didn't want this this time. Doesn't matter. It's cool. Da, 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 da. We're using Anastasia brow pencil. What time is it, ladies? Mm. So, it's quarter, quarter after six. one. Oh shit. Oh, it's fine, I've got time. Can you stop talking, please? I can't get precise. This is my finished makeup look. You know what it is? I think the wing needs to be a bit thicker. Thicker? It just looks like you've just, like, coloured my eye and then just done a straight line. I mean, it looks fantastic. Like, do you see that? I can make it. Does it, it really look like a wing? Because you put stuff underneath my eye, which I didn't like. I I need... <sighs> like look at that wing and then look at that wing yeah you need to sort the eyes out okay because yeah you need to sort this wing out take makeup off what time is it half six okay i've got half an hour can you just fix my eyes please um but anyway this is what i'm gonna wear I have tried it on and it does look nice, but I just don't know if, because it's a black dress and I've got like long black hair, I don't know if I'm going to look too dark. So I do have another option, which is like a corset and this little like white frilly skirt. So we'll see, but I'll try on the black dress on first because that was my favourite. Okay, I am ready. This is my outfit. So the corset is PLT and then the skirt is actually House of CB, but the other outfit, I just preferred this one. Got some butterfly hoops in, which look really cute. I actually wore these at Coachella, but then I've just got clear heels on, and I'm all ready to go. I feel really cute in this outfit. It's like, it's quite summer, summer core, but it's cute. I feel nice and like comfortable, and I'm just actually starving, so I'll, um, I'm gonna go now. It's about a half an hour drive, but I'm excited. Yeah, okay,